Hey guys, welcome back to Super Jess TV. Today I'm sitting here on my desk um, trying to create a grocery list but also do some meal planning or meal scheduling. I don't really know where I'm going with this video but I had this idea to kind of film it because I think it'll be helpful for you guys. We're all kind of on the same predicament right now. We're homeschooling or social, what is it called? <laughs> or distance learning. So um, yeah, I know that one of the biggest challenges right now for parents is keeping your kids fed because as we know, they're asking for snacks <laughs> all the time. So I really wanna have a good start. We haven't started classes yet. We're actually gonna be starting in two days. So today is Tuesday, August 18th and we don't start until Thursday, August 20th. So. I'm just trying to be on top of my game. I'm gonna go grocery shopping later. I have this going on right now, so I'm kind of creating a grocery list, and then I'm also gonna be doing some meal schedules. And then I think I'll go ahead and share with you guys what I grabbed um, after I get back from the grocery store. But that is what I'm planning right now because I know since I did um, homeschool Lily last year that one of my biggest struggles was just meal planning because I wasn't doing it I would just cook whatever I had in the fridge and sometimes it just wasn't a good overall experience so I want to be a little bit more creative I also want to get a bunch of like healthier cleaner options and um, things that I'm not gonna be feeling guilty for letting Lily snack on you know like chips and cookies and things like that which um, it's going to be a little bit hard, so let's see what happens. Um, as of right now, I'll, all I'm doing is looking up some Pinterest ideas. That's usually what I do if I want to try out something different or get, get a little creative. I do go on Pinterest often and just look up ideas. Um, but yeah, if you guys want to stick around and see what I grab, I might share some of the meal ideas that I do throughout the week. So this might be a cumulative video of like two or three days depending on um, when I get to post this because I do have a bunch of pre-filmed videos. But anyways, if this is the first time you're here, my name is Jessica, welcome. I would love for you guys to subscribe to this channel. I share a lot of motherhood and homeschool inspirational videos. Um, and lately, you guys know, I've been talking a lot about K-12 because I know a lot of you guys are now interested. So if you guys want to see some K-12 videos, there will be a playlist at the end of this video so go ahead and make sure you guys subscribe and turn on your notification bells i do post three times per week monday wednesday friday and let's see where i go with this video hey guys so it's been a while later and i'm in the car now with lily have my grocery list we're headed to walmart it's super hot we have the ac going so i hope you guys can hear me but let's see what happens let's see if i stick to my list because usually i tend to make a list and then sometimes it doesn't really work anyways we'll see you guys in a bit okay guys so it's been a few hours later i am back i have my whole grocery haul right here on the table i'm not really going to go into all of that because i know maybe you guys don't like seeing my grocery hauls but let me just tell you guys i found some pretty good options at walmart for like clean foods um clean snacks if you guys didn't see my organic food haul, um, I kind of mentioned that we're trying to eat less sugary foods, less processed foods. So we're trying to, you know, kind of have a small change in our eating habits um, and see how we feel, hopefully better. But um, yeah, so this is what we got. This is an overall. I'm just gonna point out the things that are gonna be used for like snacking for Lily while she's doing homeschool. So I wanted to have good, um, I wanted to have healthier options for her. So we picked up these veggie straws. Um, and these things over here, you guys, will save your life. Some fast food that she can eat, you know, if I haven't cooked a meal. Um, so these little um, options that you can throw in the microwave. So. These are Annie's Real Aged Cheddar Macaroni and Cheese. Um, there's a two pack. And then I also got her some mini corn dogs. Again, we're taking small steps, but we do have some good options like some fruit. Um, and we also got these Dino Nuggets. 
um, these are gluten free you guys and I think I paid less than three dollars for this bag for some reason I think they were getting clearance um, and yeah I had to try these out for it's the first time we're trying them out so I don't really know if they're good or not but for three dollars and a gluten free option um, I couldn't pass it up so there it is um, I also got her some black forest organic um, little fruit gummies and I did grab some other stuff but these are the things that um, we're gonna start off our week with and I'm gonna show you guys I did actually stick to my grocery list and I did schedule our next few meals um, if you guys would like me to go in depth or maybe make a or maybe film a week of um, lunch ideas or snack ideas videos just let me know but um, for this whole grocery haul, we spent $122 at Walmart, which again, there's a lot of organic stuff on here and it is a little bit pricier, but I think in the long run, it's really worth our money. So there it is, you guys. If you guys would like to see an organic haul, I do have an Algae's organic haul. I will go ahead and link it up there and um, I think I'm going to show you guys what I feed her the first week of back to school, which is going to be this Thursday and it's literally just going to be two days. So that's probably going to be here in this video. And yeah, let's guys, see what happens. So in case you guys were wondering, this is what I came up with. Basically, um, this is our meal schedule for the next six days. So as you guys can see, we started on Thursday 820 and then this is only for the next six days so we end on thursday as well and this is for their lunch basically this is what we're going to be working with for now um i don't really i've never really meal planned um but my main struggle was lunch time so that that's basically the meal i was focusing on and then as you guys can see for example excuse <laughs> the mess it actually already got messy because i have been using my meal schedule we're actually already on this week but um anyways uh yeah so as you guys can see i jotted down their lunch and then their snacks for the day they can only have two snacks for the day and then um i came up with a meal schedule first and then based on that um i started adding things to my grocery list if we didn't have it here at home but yeah this is my little system right now let me know if you guys have any suggestions um and yeah there it is in case you guys were wondering Okay, you guys, so as promised, I wanted to share with you all our lunch for today. And I just dropped it on the floor. So these are the little dino nuggets that um, I got at Walmart. They're gluten-free. And um, as you guys see, I have the little veggie sticks. These are the cheddar um, flavor and then some strawberries. And let me go ahead and give Jakey his lunch because he is starving, apparently. And, and this is his and he's gonna be drinking a bit of um, almond chocolate milk in here and this is Lily's plate she is having the exact same thing some strawberries the little chicken nuggets the veggie stick chips and we actually save our extra sauces this is barbecue honey barbecue uh, sauce from McDonald's so she has that and she's also drinking some chocolate milk can you do a little taste test on the um, chicken nuggets Lily let us know if they're good okay Is it good? Yeah? Can I try one? Let's see. I'm gonna dunk it in there. Mmm. Oh, they don't taste bad at all. They taste the same like we usually get. Mm-hmm. They don't taste I mean this is real chicken. It's just gluten free. So, yeah, I was just surprised because the bag was under $3. I need to remember how much this was. And maybe they're just discontinu discontinuing it. Or maybe the store is just not going to carry it. So, they're pretty good. I ended up chopping up Jakey's chicken. In case you guys were wondering. Because he will stuff his face. Yeah, I cut it. And then Lily asked for pickles. The end. Okay, so this is their breakfast today. They're going to have scrambled eggs. Some cantaloupe. And this is um, organic whole wheat bread. They're both having the same thing. And they're both going to have one of these little 
These are little probiotic drinks. They taste really good. I think Lily likes these. She never fuzzes when she has these. Hey guys, so thank you so much if you made it to the end of this video. As always, if you did make it here, make sure you leave a little emoji uh, comment down below so that I know you were here. Um, I really just wanted to pop on here and say thank you so much for all your support. I hope this video was inspirational for you all. It's been a little bit of a hectic week for us. We just started homeschool. I did go ahead and post our first day back to school video if you guys haven't checked that out i will go ahead and link it up above but yeah with that being said it's been it's been crazy it's been a little it's been pretty busy so i'm so grateful right now that i did my best at getting us ready um and meal prepping was the best thing i could have done honestly because one of the biggest struggles right now for parents at home is getting our kids fed now that they're home we're doing breakfast lunch dinner and snacks so um yeah if you guys found this video helpful or inspirational at all let me know if you guys want to see more content like this um i know you guys really enjoy the routine videos and seeing what our day-to-day -day life looks like um but i really do enjoy putting these videos together for you guys as well so let me know which type of videos you guys want to see next so that i can film that for you and leave a comment down below but anyways, with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and make sure you guys turn on your notifications. That way you guys can stay up to date with the latest videos. And I guess that's it for this video. I hope you guys have a good one, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye. Yeah.